Hey there everyone and welcome back to Google Guru. Yesterday the Google Drive team announced a few different updates to Google Sheets and these center around filter views. So if you're familiar with the new version of Google Sheets, filter views is only available there. So if you're using the old version of Google Sheets, you won't be able to see these updates. So the first update that I want to cover deals with sharing a specific filter view with another collaborator. So if I go into my filter views here, I can see that I have uh, filter views separated by my different quarters in this sales numbers spreadsheet. So if I open up the Q1 filter view, sometimes if you're working with a collaborator, it can be a little bit tricky to have them know exactly which section of a spreadsheet that you're referring to. So now with this update, I can actually share this specific filter view with my collaborator. So all you need to do is just copy the URL from the top of your screen. You can't see it here, it's actually off the screen, but if you just copy the URL from your URL bar at the top of your screen, and then I'll go over to the collaborators window. And if I paste the URL here, or if you just share it with them in an email or chat, once they open up that specific URL, it'll launch the specific filter view. So this is a really useful feature, I think it'll definitely help improve the collaboration experience between different users. So while we're in this spreadsheet view, the other updates that came to Google Sheets deal with collaborators who only have view access to a spreadsheet. So if you're dealing with a lot of data and you only have view access, it can be kind of tricky to sort and view that data because previously you couldn't filter it. So now users with view only access can filter through filter views. So if I go to data, and filter views, I can create a new temporary filter view. So this won't change anything that my other collaborators see. It will only affect what I see here in this filter view. So I can change it here and say, let's only take a look at the East region. So this definitely makes it easy for those of you who only have view access to a spreadsheet. So the last update deals with changing the range in filter views. So Previously, if you wanted to change the range in a filter view that you'd already created, you would have had to delete it and then recreate it with a new range. So now I can just go in here and say, let's shorten down this uh, range here just a little bit. So that's just another you know time saver here in Google Sheets along with these other updates to filter views. If you have any questions about this update, feel free to leave us a comment in the section below the video. Thanks.